hello 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 and welcome back to my channel welcome back to the wrap and scraps channel i hope you guys are all doing well having a wonderful day being productive living and loving life so last month i couldn't really do much because i had just had the whole mommy makeover if you haven't seen that check out my, my mommy makeover videos um they're in my playlist under surgery so check that out but i finally got out of the house i finally got to go into a store and buy some stuff and i didn't want to go and buy clothes yet because i was still like my body's still adjusting um, i picked up a few things here and there but i didn't want to go and get anything you know that i may not be able to fit soon but i wanted to shop i had that itch so i went to the coach outlet so i am in california and where i am i have one that's about an hour away and then one that's about 45 minutes away so i went in there and so i'm going to show you what i got let me see what we're gonna start with first these are the purses that i picked up from the coach outlet um at the cabazon mall here in california all right um i just wanted to shop last month and so i did i bought a lot of stuff i'm, I'm gonna show you guys some more um in the next video of other things i bought but this one is just specifically coach related so the first one i got i mean this is considered the signature run tote just a little small tote um absolutely love it great cross body and now i picked this one up for my everyday shopping if i'm just running a couple of quick errands but i'm not really going into the mall i'm not going to be purchasing a lot of stuff to you know put in my purse so, you know the mall you have to carry it as you go you're not going to run to the car every time you come out of the store so um i, I reserve those those runs for my big tote bags if i'm just going to the grocery store if i'm just going to drop kids off at school or here and running for a doctor's appointment or something like that and if it matches my outfit i'm gonna go with this one really cute i love the size it's a perfect size i took this to disneyland recently and it was great um not too heavy love that it has feet on it okay this one retail for one 118 okay 118 when i purchased it and you can wear it just like this and that's fine too you could just wear it just like that okay so so that's what i paid for that one also it has a little cute little wallet here um that i picked up for 29 dollars. also this wallet has the slots for cards so you can use it as a wallet and or a makeup case i like the diversity of that so that's that moving on to the next size i guess that would be this one here so this is the newest one that i picked up this is new to the market if you go to the coach store you're going to see this maybe some of them haven't even received it yet you have to be a coach insider to uh see the early things that's not hard to be just go ahead and um put in your email and all that jazz and they will allow you to see what's up and coming so i've been eyeballing this for about a month now this is the purse i originally went in to purchase but when i got there they didn't have any so i actually found this purse closer to carlsbad area i had to go to a different um outlet to find it really really love it it is fabric the fabric canvas very nice very beautiful it's different i love the um it's almost like a god a burgundy reddish um inside i love the zip so that if you have things that are more personable for you they can go in the zip and if not they can go on the sides of the tote it does have one pocket here in the zip as you can see and it zips right on up and then you have plenty of space on either side for other things let's see if we can fit a computer in there shall we so i've got my lappy right here got my laptop 13 inch i believe it is aha you see that it went right on in there so the laptop if you have a laptop and you want to use this as a work bag it will it work bag it will fit let's check out the bottom take the seat off there there's the bottom there's the top sides not too heavy nice little weight to it um it's just just it's a shoulder bag it does not have a cross body okay but I really, really like it. I paid. So for this one, this is the um, the khaki saddle. I paid $3.28 for this one. $3.28 at the Coach Outlet. Okay. Um, I think there was a 15% discount. So I might have got it for a little less. $3.20 or something like that. There she is. That's that. 
And of course, I like to get the matching wallets. They didn't have the actual wallet in yet, but they did have the matching little, um, you can, I guess you can call it a wallet. <laughs> and this was, um, this is khaki black multi. This is what the purse comes up as, khaki black multi color. And the little wallet was 118, okay? So I paid 118 for the little wallet. You can put, put cards in here or you can use it as a makeup case as I've stated previously in the other one. So I love that. This goes right on in here and that's perfect. So that's that purse, that's the multicolor khaki. And I also, all right, so this is the one that I went in to get as well. This is the Molly I'm in Love um, bag. All right, there she is with all her goodness in there. And um, Okay, you guys, so with these two, um, as you see, they match the bag that I have, the tote that I have. Um, I really wanted to just, you know, I like to have a full set when I get a purse. So I wanted the wallet, but they didn't have any wallets yet. Um, they didn't have any wallets. So I, I went ahead and got this. I spilled some lotion in there already y'all i gotta clean them out is that lotion yeah lotion deodorant or lotion one of the two anyhow so this one has a card slot where you can put this one has a card slot where you can put cards in there or you can use it as a makeup pouch of which i've been using it as which is why it has that in there <laughs> um but i will but question for you ladies do any of you ladies spray your fabric purses with scotch guard I am considering spraying some of my purses with Scotch Guard, the ones that are fabric, but I'm not sure. I'm probably have to look it up and see, but let me know in the comments. All right, so also I got this little planner here, little um, note taker really. Uh, it was $40, so I paid $40 for this. This one was $120. Um, I think I got it. Yeah, no, I think I actually paid $120 for it. So I have that one. This one was $40. I love that you can take it out you know um, you know put another one it doesn't have to be coach but just another one you know you can buy these anywhere you can find these i thought that would be a good investment to go ahead and get that so that is that forty dollars for this one it was on clearance it was normally 60 or 70 and then this one was 128 okay all right so that's that bag that is the molly i'm in love tote absolutely love this one i'm sure it's going to be a favorite and i do have some shoes that match it that i'm going to be wearing okay let's get into the denim this bag right here has become one of my favorites it is huge as you can see comes with crossbody strap that i absolutely love um let me show you how this hooks up so i think it's important ladies that you do something for yourself every now and again um for me i'm on this new journey of self-love <laughs> self-love and a little bit of selfishness a little bit because it's needed at this point in my life um do some things for you sometimes it's okay it's all right to love you sometimes okay so this is the tote um i'm gonna tell you what i love about this of course the strap comes off it can be on or off i love the bottom leather here okay it does have feet as you can see i love the white trim and how all of the denim looks. This is great if you're wearing blue jeans. This is great if you're wearing sundresses. Like I have a white um, maxi dress. This would look really good with that. Shorts. Okay, this one was 202. That's with all the discounts that I got. Okay. It was normally 450, but I had some discounts. Okay, so I paid 202 for this beautiful, lovely tote. And for the wallet, the matching wallet. I pay $225 for the matching wallet. I got discount, so it came out to $116 for the matching wallet. And it's a full wallet. Let me cover all my information. It's a full wallet, you guys. Okay. So that's the matching wallet. I just seen that they posted the matching makeup bag, which I'm probably gonna get. Um, so that is the wallet there. Very nice. Fits nicely in there. I mean, there's so much space in there. So in here, this purse, you have a zippy on this side, as you can see. You turn it around. You have two slots there and a zippy on that side, okay? As you can see, that's a lot of room in there. 
Okay, that's a full size wallet. You see how much space is in there? Now here's what I like about this purse. You see the straps? They can completely go in. They completely go in and it closes just like that if you want to carry the crossbody. Okay, so this is the crossbody here. As you can see, you can have it like a regular tote or you can expand it if you so choose to. Very, it's really simple to um, to work. And I like this fabric. Look at the fabric. I don't know if you can see that. See how soft that is? It's so comfortable. It doesn't dig into your um, shoulder. It doesn't hurt. Okay, so excuse me how shiny I am, you guys. It's been a long day. All right, so here we are with the crossbody. All right, that's how that looks. And this is how I carry it. I start off with it on my shoulder. Well, I actually start off with it on my wrist, holding it or holding it in my hand. And then the more I shop, the heavier it get. Then it goes to the shoulder and then it gets too heavy for that and it goes as crossbody. And so I'm usually coming out of the store, holding it like this half the time, depending on what I bought, walking like this, okay? But it's a really beautiful bag. A lot of compliments on this bag. Now, with this bag, I can show you the sandals I purchased guys excuse my craft room it's a hot mess okay so when i got this bag here again this is the denim bag i went on ahead and got the white coat shoes to go with this bag okay so that's that those shoes and the coat shoes were on sale for 50 dollars each so that's really good so i got those for 50 bucks each okay so the pink ones the green ones and then so the pink ones, for the green ones, I really got to go with this, with the Molly I'm in love tote, okay? So those are the green ones. And they do run a little small. I had to go a size, a half a size up. So these, I'm a, normally a nine. These are nine and a half, okay? So I got those and then I had to get them in pink. Of course, that way I had options. But I got the green ones because I don't have any green shoes. I do not have any green sandals. And so I said, well, they're on sale. Let me go ahead and get them. So overall, um, oh, and then I didn't get this from the coach store. I didn't get this from the coach store. I got this from a thrift store called Savers. The wallet they have is a coach wallet. Still really, really in great, great condition, as you can see. <clears throat> really, really good condition. I just cleaned it up. Look at that. Great condition. Has a snap on this side. Okay, because I needed a wallet. I like to match. So I needed a wallet to go with this one. And since it has that creamy white color in the middle, I figured this would perfectly go with that um, until they come out with the one that matches it. So for this purse, I have these two. All right, <clears throat> the, the hardware on here is silver. But that's okay. When they come out with a matching one, I'll, I'll snatch it up. But um, I paid $29 for this. Okay, so that's what goes there in that one. And that is all the purses I got. The hardware is so beautiful. The colors are so beautiful. Um, I just love it. The next purchase, big purchase. This, I probably spent, oh God, let me add it up, Lord. Because there was some other stuff. Think, yeah, because I bought one for my mother as well. So I say $1,700 I spent on all of these purses that you see right here with the matching goodies and all that stuff in them and the shoes, which is not bad. Now, what I really want is that armor bag at the Louis Vuitton store. I'm a hard worker and I feel that I need to treat myself. <clears throat> I need to treat myself for recovering from a mommy makeover that I'm still recovering from, but I still need to treat myself. And I, I just think that it would be a very wise decision for me to go down there and just look at the leads, just go see what they got. So y'all stay tuned. Cause I, I promise you in probably the next couple of weeks, you're going to see me with either the on the go bag or the Alma in the dim in the dimmier, dimmier uh, pattern, if I'm correctly pronouncing that. Demier or Demier, whichever one. I'm going to get it. I'm going to get it. And I might film it so you guys can see the process of that. I have been looking on the real real 
Fashion Nova, all that stuff, right? Fashion, foul, foul, fashion, fashion, foul. All the stores where you can buy um, pre-love and all that stuff, post-love, whatever. Bags, I'm not at all against buying secondhand bags. Y'all who know me know I love to save my money. I love to save my money. I like to save my coins, okay? I got four kids and a grandbaby that's going to be here in two months. Well, hell, five, because my son, too. So, five kids and grandbaby that's going to be here in two months, okay? And I like to save my coins. But I like to treat myself, too. I'm, I'm learning how to do it. And I think I'm doing pretty well, can't you see? I'm doing, I'm learning this very, very quickly. So, soon, <coughs> very soon, we're going to see Louis. We're going to see Louis de Vuitton, okay? And I will share that with you guys. I'll bring you guys with me. Um, I keep changing my mind. You know, it's one of those things where you'd be like, okay, should I buy this or should I buy a new sofa set? Because, I mean, the prices, I mean, let's just be honest. They're up there. It's a luxury brand, so you, you're, paying the, you're paying the coinage for it. So I keep going back and forth. There's a lot of things around the house that I'm doing, and it's not stopping me from doing it. I'm still doing it. But I'm just like, should I just do everything I want to do for the house first and then get it? But then I'm like, no, I don't want to do that because every time I've done that, I've never went and got it. So I'm really trying to um, reason with myself and convince myself to go ahead and get it. You know, um, I'm paying for it. So it's not like I have to go ask somebody else for it. It's just the principle of do I want to put all my coins in that one bucket or do I want to do other things with it? And I'm so confused. I don't know. But anywho, I hope you guys are having a good day. Um, our family's dealing with some things right now. We had a loss in the family and I'm trying to stay upbeat and positive, but there's a lot of pain and hurt going on right now. A lot of, um, you know, just things. And so I'm tell I tell myself, like I tell you guys, how I say stay wrapped in scraps, meaning repurpose, recycle, reuse all parts of your life, right? And right now I'm feeling pretty down. So I figured, you know, I can at least try to put a smile on someone else's face and show some beautiful bags and talk about staying encouraged and uplifted, even though right now I'm pretty down and, and not feeling my greatest. Um, you know, anytime there's a loss in the family, there's going to be some sadness. There's going to be some anger. There's, you're going to go through the five stages of losses. So, you know, especially right now with Corona, I know there's not, I'm not the only one that's lost somebody. Um, not saying that it's to that, but I'm, I know people lose people. That's just a part of life. And, you know, it, it hurts more when the person is young, you know, and um, the, the relative I lost was um, barely at the end of her twenties. And, uh, you know, it's hurtful. So, I'm praying for all of you that if you're dealing with some, some pain from a loss, uh, seek God, seek God, pray about it, get some peace, put on some prayer, some praise and worship, maybe put on some preaching and just leave it on and just let that feed into your spirit. Because sometimes you can't really have, there isn't any comfort, but, the, but the comforter, if you know what I mean. Okay. So stay wrapped in scraps, stay loving you. Life is sometimes throw some things at you stay loving you okay god regardless of what's going on is always good stay loving god stay loving life and i'll see you guys in the next video bye guys